there, my name is Bill Marion and this is A Nose for Life. My least favorite time to visit Gatlinburg, Tennessee is during the hottest part of the summer. Sure, some of the prettiest mountain streams in the world can be found around here in these mountains, and yes, there are water parks and so on to help your family beat the heat. After all, what's a tourist destination without water parks, river tubing, and theme parks? But I grew up in this region, and the summer isn't the best time to visit the Smoky Mountains. At least I don't think so. And what I think, well, that matters the most, at least to me. I'd rather be here any time of year than in the middle of the summer, and that's a fact. I guess that's the locals' perspective, even though I'm not actually a local. And speaking of being local, these are exciting times in the Marion House because we've spent the past month moving from the Shenandoah Valley back to the Tennessee Valley. We love spending the past five years in the Shenandoah Valley of Virginia and roaming the mountains of West Virginia. We made so many friends who we will miss. But God moved us back to the Tennessee Valley and we're in for an amazing adventure. There'll be plenty of time to tell you all about that adventure in future videos. But for now, let's talk about Canada's invasion of the Smoky Mountains. Smoke from wildfires are surfing air currents and finding their way to the Smoky Mountains. Now, most of the time, the folks around here welcome, or more like tolerate, Yankees for their tourist dollars. But the smoke from Western Canada hasn't added anything but misery to the Smoky Mountains. Hundreds of wildfires are burning out of control, according to the National Canadian Wildland Firefighters. Smoke from these fires have even reached Europe. It's not just one fire, it's several fires across 11 Canadian territories and provinces. And here, well, it's smoky and hot, but would you look at the size of this buck at Cades Cove? But then again, is there really a bad time to visit the mountains of East Tennessee and Gatlinburg for that matter? Yes, it's hot, but for our family and countless other families throughout the years, Gatlinburg and a loop around Cades Cove is more than just a vacation. It's a family reunion and a time to catch up. So when mom and Dennis invited us to enjoy a day trip to Gatlinburg and the Cades Cove loop, of course we said yes. And even having to endure a hot day in the mountains of East Tennessee with people you love and people who love you is better than any other kind of day in a lot of other places. So we had a great time and you'll enjoy Gatlinburg too any time of year. But if you can choose when to visit the area, I'd come in the fall. I'm just saying. Excuse me, ma'am. Can I help you? I never seen anything like that in my life. Uh...
Like everyone else who comes to the Smokies, we have our favorite places too. And one of those places is the Christmas Place at Pigeon Forge. A couple of days ago, I released a short about this amazing year-round Christmas shopping experience, but I have no idea if our short videos will circulate or not. Sometimes they do, and sometimes they don't. So I wanted to show you more in this video so you could see how amazing this place really is. Like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, we've spent the summer packing and moving. But listen to this, even though we've made fewer videos this year, our channel has done well this summer. We've added about 700 subscribers over the past three months. And over the same amount of time, our channel received about 100,000 more views. Now this success has a lot to do with this video. If you haven't seen it, here's a tab in the right corner of your screen. A lot of people like this video, and I think you will too if you haven't seen it. Never forget, you make this channel work, and I'm so grateful you take the time to watch our videos. Thank you. We're so very grateful. We're looking forward to getting back into a routine and bringing you some great video content. So make sure you're subscribed. You want to make sure that you've clicked the bell for notifications. And finally, we want to hear what you have to say. We do our very best to respond to every single comment. And comments really help our channel. Even if you miss a notification, our channel is likely to show up in your recommended page if you comment. So again, thank you so much for watching. Until Till our next video, here are some other videos you might enjoy. I'm Bill Marion, and this is A Nose for Life.